Hello guys, welcome back to The Last of Us. This is probably gonna be the last episode of this game, until the DLC content, of course. Uh, Joe and Ellie have finally arrived at the Firefly headquarters, and this time uh, we actually found them. But they are sending Ellie straight to the operation room, and the operation will kill her. Joe is a little upset about this situation, so he decides to kill everyone and get Ellie out. And that's where we are. Okay. So I like all the thugs we have uh, encountered before. The fireflies are very well trained. As you can see, they are very lethal. This is gonna be <laughs> quite difficult. They're not gonna like that. Maybe I should just stay here. Oh. I should be. I really should load every weapon I got. Such as the El Diablo. Come on, no ammo for the El Diablo. Holy shit. I don't even know how I survived that. Oh, I got an assault rifle. That's very helpful. I, I, like, I like using assault rifles. But <laughs> point me to another game where the assault rifle is part of the arsenal of this game but you only get it like in the last uh, last very section of the game final hour or something because usually assault rifle is the first thing you get then you get the varieties of a shotgun or a, a sniper rifle all that kind of stuff One shot for the El Diablo. There's a uh, guy over there. Let's El Diablo him. Didn't work as well as I thought. Oh yeah. Taste of your own poisons. You know... I really don't know if it's justifiable anymore to kill all these fireflies. I suppose... I suppose in... The, in the name of saving Ellie, you can argue for everything. I gotta say I'm a pretty good shot. <laughs> I don't know about... Not a very good tactician, for sure, but...
Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. <sighs> Got nothing. Right, I'm just gonna... Uh, the uh, shotgun is not an ideal weapon for long range or even mid range. Maybe I didn't upgrade the range. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Fucking shit! I need more ammo, guys. You give me some. <laughs> Do I want a bottle or a brick? I don't know. Don't make me make a decision like that. Um, where do I need to go? I think I've cleared this whole wing. Oh, this is the wrong weapon. I don't know if flamethrower is the best idea with these guys. No, you! That was the greatest comeback of all time. Oh, no, no, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I was... Uh, I was trying to grab the, the ammo on the ground. Shit! Taken from the patient, rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. 
However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines. And an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're about to hit a milestone in human history, equal to the discovery of penicillin. After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home, make a difference, and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. Firefly pendant. It's finally normal to find the firefly pendants in place. In this place. Oh yeah. El Diablo. Whose journal was this? Was this Marlene's? Oh yeah, it's Marlene's journal. March 15, we finally crossed the Utah border. In a couple of days, we'll be back with the others. Today, the crew was in much better spirits. I've been worried about their morale since Greg and Tanya's passing last week. It's good to hear them laughing again. Robin came up to me and said, thanks for watching over us, Marlene. It was a small gesture, but I needed it. Ellie never made it. We arrived at the hospital. There was much celebration, at least from the others. I guess they're happy to see their old friends. We haven't seen some of these guys in over 10 years. After they told me the news, I couldn't eat. I couldn't talk to anyone. I should be grateful to just be alive, but right now I just want to shut my eyes for a bit. Uh, how did they know Ellie didn't make it? March 24. They look at me and I know what they're thinking. That we're a bunch of incompetent grunts. What was I supposed to do? I thought I was going to die. My men were being hunted by the entire Boston Battalion. I had to get her out of the city. How was I supposed to know the Firefly escorts were already dead? God damn it, I panicked. In the end, I healed pretty damn quickly. My men were more capable than I gave them credit for. More than a handful survived the army's attack. I should have kept her with me. Instead, I handed her off to a couple of smugglers. I failed you, Anna. I failed all of us. I'm an incompetent grant. Yeah, when you think about it, she got here faster than we did so it was probably better for her to just take Ellie along uh, I can't stand talking to any of them I don't think I can take the stairs any longer no way I can stay here one of our scouts just radioed in he spotted an older man and young girl entering the tunnel by the bus terminal he thinks she might have had red hair but he's not sure what if it's her stop doing this Marlene the recon squad is about to head out I'm going to join them and after that, when you're lost in the darkness, look for the light. She's alive. They're running the tests on her now. I can't tell if I'm excited, scared, or just nervous. All I know is my hands won't stop shaking. <sighs> Everybody's making tough calls in this game. Can you blame Marlene for doing this? Exactly? Okay, that, that's a lot of personnel over there. I'm coming, Ellie. I think that just shed a lot of light on why Marlene's doing what she did. Like, sh she's got more than Ellie's well-being to take care of. I like Joe here. And she's under a lot of pressure from the other fireflies. Because a lot of them lost uh, their 
brothers, sisters, friends, families, in order to to get Ellie into that lab. What was that? And even though, uh, and from Marty's perspective, she might be reluctant to do that. Wow, you got you survived the two shots of the from the El Diablo. I hope you're proud of that. Why didn't that work? Uh oh! Somebody stepped on the trap! I meant that for more of you! Yeah, back at ya. the clumsy way of doing it but it's still effective Jeez. So from the look of things, I think Anna's mother and Marlene, they were working on a cure for this infection. I think maybe Mar uh, maybe Anna, Ellie's mother, maybe she tested it on herself and she passed that down to Ellie when she gave birth to her. Okay, let's get on with it. But maybe because she died so soon and uh, they never knew if it worked or not. Maybe it didn't work on Anna itself. Maybe it just passed down to her. Maybe it was recessive in Anna. And holy shit. We better get in there fast. Sweet Jesus. Doctor? 
What are you doing in here? I won't let you take her. This don't come any closer. Well, at least they haven't started. I mean it. Now, if you are like, let me just reload right in front of you. Uh, if you're wondering if maybe we could spare him because he's just doing his job. He's not, maybe not a bad person. He's a doctor. We could use more doctors. Maybe we just take Ellie and they can't do anything to stop us. No. You have to kill at least one of them. Although I will admit that it's not strictly necessary to burn him. You do still have to kill him. You can also kill the rest of them. But I would choose not to. Come Enough on, people have girl. died here. I got you. I got you. <coughs> oh shit. <coughs> oh, we're getting out. Shit. I'm getting you out of here, girl. I got you. I got you. Come on. Tell me which way. Not that way. <laughs> Shit. No. Let go of her. Let go of her. No. Well, that didn't work too well. Come on. Oh really no? Oh, elevator, go. I said get back. Stop. You can't save her. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. Jeez. It ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. Well, you didn't get to ask her, did you? And you know it. Look. You can still the right thing here she won't feel anything it is probably what Ellie would have chosen if they gave her a chance to make the choice herself it sounds like they would force this on her no matter what she chose but I do believe Ellie would have chosen to go through with it are still wearing off. What happened? We found the fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. I ain't done them a damn bit of good, neither. It's not true, though. They've actually... St They've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking this home. I'm sorry.
Wait. Let me go. Please. You just come after her. She will come after her. Now Joe's got her wondering if that was all for us. Like we're walking squat. Because Ellie really believed in this mission. Like, she oh, we're playing Ellie again. All right. It's actually kind of pretty, ain't it? Yeah. Earlier, when Joe suggested that they can just be done with this whole thing. Uh, Ellie was like this whole feeling my age now. After everything this has to mean something and now she feels like it has not meant all that. I don't think I ever told you, but uh Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think uh I think the two of you would have been would have been good friends if you really would have loved. I bet I would have. We're still collecting magazines. Is that like the only magazine in this universe that has ever been popular? Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. That's a great line, by the way. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what. He's touching his watch when he said that. You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear though, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. I swear. Got tears in our eyes. Okay. Whew. Now I'm gonna temporarily turn down the game music here. Wow, what a fantastic experience. This is my second time playing this game and the, the magic is not lost 
at all. In fact, because I know what's coming, well, that has deprived the uh, I guess both of us some precious reactions, some oh my god moments. It has allowed me to notice a lot of details, a lot of foreshadowings, and a lot of poetic parallels fr uh, from various sections of the game. Uh, and I do think, as far as uh, story is concerned, this is the best game ever made. I, I do believe that, at least uh, among all the games that I've played or the stories that I'm familiar with. I guess God of War is also up there, the 2018 one. So I, I really can't wait for the second game to come out. It's It shouldn't be too far away now, it's a few months time. And uh, I, I think, I don't know this for sure, but I think the game will be kind of like Godfather Part 2. Like uh, both the sequel and a prequel of sorts. Uh, the prequel part, I don't know how long, we're probably going to dive back into the history between Ellie's mother and Marlene. And we're gonna see exactly how Ellie came to be immune. As for the sequel part, which I think is the bulk of that game, I, I at least know that we are going to be playing as Ellie for the majority of it. At least the majority, if not all of it. I don't know if we're going to be playing as Joe again. Joe is in uh, Joe is in the game to what capacity I'm not sure he's in the trailers um, well it's going to take place a few years from now so Ellie is a grown-up young woman but a deadly one well tender still a tender young woman but deadly as hell I I can't wait Naughty Dog has shaped itself as master of a uh, storytelling in the video game uh, or in the uh, format and Neil Drakeman Neil Druckmann right there he's uh he's a pretty crucial piece of all that all of this you got Ashley Johnson and the Troy Baker as magnificent uh voice actors oh, oh. actually everybody did a superb job in this and after this one, I'm going to be playing uh, the uh, Left Behind DLC, which is probably going to come up next. And then we'll be playing something else and in anticipation of the sequel. This really is one of my favorite video games out there. It's one of my favorite anything out there. So again, once again, thank you so much for watching this playthrough. Thanks so much for joining me in this journey. If you haven't played this yourself, uh, even though you have gone through all this and you know the story yourself, I still recommend you with all my heart to, to play this for yourself at least uh, one, at least once. It's because it's gonna be different. This is not the kind of video game. Maybe, maybe some video games are like that, like the Telltale Adventure stories. That watching somebody else play is not all that different from playing it by, for yourself. I'm telling you, even though this is a linear game, even though it looks like the story is what it is and you can't deviate too much from it, it's a whole different experience uh, to, to play this for yourself. Um, that's all I'm gonna, uh, that's all I gotta say. Thank you again for watching. Look forward to the DLC, look forward to further playthroughs. And uh, I'm going to sign off now. Uh, for one last time, uh, uh, if, you, if you like this playthrough, please give this video a like. Please subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below. Uh, also, you can, find, you can follow me on Twitter under the same username. So I'm going to let the credits roll uh, to the end because I think everybody who worked on this game deserves... Oh, the credits, I think it's coming to an end. Uh, no, it, everybody has who has worked on this game deserves a shout-out. And uh, I'm going to sign out now. See you next time.